Now, if you work in any kind of a business or in any commercial capacity, what was happening in the news can be very important for you. And especially, you know, we are living in a world which is really quite uncertain. And even today, if I look at the news, today is, well, it's late November, COVID news. If I just type in COVID news, and it seems that there's a huge concern about a new variant and that new variant has had an impact on stock prices, on oil futures, on even cryptocurrencies uh, as a new coronavirus variant spooks markets and so on. So whether you're in the finance sector like Today, this particular news has had an impact on the finance sector, on the travel sector, on the retail sector, almost everywhere, really. So yes, you can troll the different websites like Google News to get your news, fair enough. But there's another way of getting your news and you won't get your news with all of these bells and whistles, but, you know, just to get an idea of the top headlines. And that is, the, and you can do that through this package called Fin News. I've installed this pip install fin news and we are going to look at the top news headlines published on CNBC which is an American news channel from PP print import PP print from you don't need to sign up or anything from finnews.client import news. And now I'm going to create an instance of the news client. So here I've imported news and I'm going to create an instance of news client. news and now I'm going to grab the CNBC news client and this is where I'm going to get my headlines and stuff from news dot client dot CNBC Now we are going to grab the top news, which is the top news items of the day by calling the function CNB as news client dot news feed because we are obtaining these data from the news feed and the topic is, you know, whatever has been classified as top news. Look at that. Of course, once you analyze these, you know, you get the top news. You can do something as simple as, you know, getting an idea of how the market may move. Like today, everything is going to be down to going all the way to carrying out proper sentiment analyses. Right. So it's not very well formatted, but you get the title. Children in the Netherlands are the world's happiest. Germany death toll has surpassed 100k. Merkel's push for German lockdown and there's an expiration date on COVID vaccine. So you know, like right away I get an idea of what's more or less happening in the world. <laughs> 